In this video, we're checking out the Black Arts Toneworks Raw Heart Overdrive. This pedal was designed with the help of Mike Scheidt of Yob and formed the basis of his tone on their latest LP, Our Raw Heart. So I guarantee you're going to want to stick around and check this one out, and we're starting right now. What's up guys, Steve Reese here again from Does It Doom, the YouTube channel where we feature weekly guitar lessons and gear demos in the stoner, doom, sludge, and drone metal genres. So if that's your type of thing, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell for more weekly doom content. The Raw Heart Overdrive was a collaborative effort between Mike Scheid of Yob and Black Arts Toneworks and combines two of the standard Black Arts Toneworks circuits. On this side of the pedal, you've got a Black Arts Witchburner, and on this side, you've got the Quantum Mystic, which was Black Arts Toneworks' first Mike Scheidt custom pedal. On the right side of the pedal, we have the Witchburner controls. The circuit contained in this pedal is a lower gain version of that which is typically available in the production model. In general, the circuit is Tube Screamer based with a wider frequency response combined with a reduced gain and compression. You've got controls for both volume and gain, while the high end is accentuated using this treble knob. On the left side of the pedal, we have the Quantum Mystic controls. The Quantum Mystic is based on Mike's longtime go-to dirt pedal, the Ross Distortion. The guys at Black Arts took that circuit and added a three-band active EQ between the gain stages, so you can use the EQ to drive the distortion as well as control the frequency response. And of course, you've got controls on this side for volume and gain as well, along with the bass, mids, and treble controls. The center toggle switch is set to point towards whichever circuit you want first when both sides of the pedal are engaged. In this shot of the pedal, we've got Mike's baseline settings for Yob. He will tweak a little bit depending on the backline amp or the room. He also uses both sides of the pedal independently as well. I also want to note that Mike uses a clean amp exclusively, currently a high watt clone, and he does roll off the treble to keep the jangle out of the chords. In this demo, my guitar is going to be tuned to A standard, and we're going to be playing riffs from Yob's Ablaze. If you'd like to see me do a full in-depth lesson on these riffs, just drop the comment Ablaze down below. Thank you. 
right, guys, I really hope you enjoyed that demo. If you did, please remember to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the notification bell, and if you got a friend or two who might enjoy it, don't forget to share it. For more information on Black Arts Toneworks, you can check them out at www.blackartstoneworks.com and follow them on Instagram at Black Arts Toneworks. I'll have links to both of those down in the description below. For more of my content, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, and now on your favorite podcasting platforms at Does It Doom. So until next time, always remember, Tony Iommi is your friend.